really is. Come here, pal. Oh, oh, happy birthday. How are you doing? Uh, listen, sorry, we're cutting it fine for school. We have pancakes for breakfast. You did? Hey, and guess what? We've got loads of treats for your party later, haven't we? Oh, yeah, proper birthday banquet. <laughs> are you ready for sports day? Oh, yeah, I'm going to win all my races then. Oh. Hey, look at that. I think we're going to be seeing a lot of that this afternoon. Right, come on, then, let's get going. Come on, then, Uncle Nick comes to my party this afternoon. Uh, oh, I don't know. I think they're probably busy. Anyway, besides, they're having another party for you tomorrow, aren't they? Why can't everyone come to both parties, please? There probably won't be enough food. You said there were loads of banquet. Well, yeah, there is. Yes. Yeah, OK, why not? So we're all grown-ups, aren't we? Mm. I mean, it's OK with me, is it? Is it all right with you? Yeah, that's great. Great. Right, we should get going now. Uh, see you, pal. Bye, Dad. Can you come to sports day? Why not? Are you more set? Go. See you later. Deep breaths. Okay, deep breaths. Yeah, and then he smeared this green mud stuff on me. Green mud? Oh, it's lovely. It's packed with like organic vitamins and natural exfoliating stuff. And this was a pleasurable experience, was it? It's a five star spa, Mum. I find it dead relaxing, me. But I feel like I need stuff like that, you know, like just to make me feel a bit special. Well, you are special. Very special. You have to say that, you're my mum. Well, I mean it. Do you know what? Me and you should go and find a posh spa. Have some proper pampering done. OK. And if you'll help get your sparkle back, that's exactly what we'll do. Mandy Tox. Mm. Do you want me to sort it? No, it's all right, I'll do it. I love having new treatments. Have you ever been baked in salt? I've eaten fish baked in salt. Oh, mum, it's amazing. They scrub you down with, like, this grey, gooey salt stuff and then bake you in the sauna for 20 minutes. Apparently, it stimulates your lymphatic system. Then they squeeze lemon all over you and serve you up with a bag of chips. You should try it. <laughs> What's that? It's just a birthday card. Oh, his birthday, is it? Simon's. It's his ninth birthday. I thought I'd just take it over. Oh, well, what, you be at school? I know, but... Well, I'll tell you what, I've got a stamp. You can post it. No, it, it won't get there in time. Mum, like, he's going to be bothered about a birthday card from you. Oh, he's a nice lad. Why do I get the feeling that you are just looking for an opportunity to go and see Leanne? <sighs> go on, get me that stamp. I do miss him, you know. And you. How's Eva? Eva's bruised. Nick treated her badly. Ah, oh, and she's an innocent angel, is she? I don't want to fight. No, neither do I. I've got enough of that going on with Peter. And I've got to enjoy sports day this afternoon. Then Carla's party. Oh, I know it's tough. But you know why you'll always be worth a million Peter Barlow's? Why? Because you care about Simon and you put him first and your own feeling second. Well, I try. Hey, listen, why don't you come tomorrow? Oh, I don't know. I'd love to, but I just... But what? Too busy? Too worried about what Eva would think? There's going to be balloon animals and everything, you know? Oh, <laughs> I love balloon animals. You know, I once saw a fella do an orangutan. Full size. Right. Mm. Oh, he'd love to see you, you know. If I sent it through the post, it would never have got there in time. Have you forgotten what she's done? He'd already split up. All right, so it's not black and white, but you know what? It'd be really nice if you were on my side for once. Oh, I am on your side, love. She says, after fraternising with the enemy. Oh, come on, give me a break. It's Simon's birthday. Yeah, well, sometimes you have to choose. Yeah, well, I've chosen, which is why Leanne is not working in the pub anymore, and me and you are going on a spa break. Oh, I managed to find a place that does that colonic hydrotherapy. Oh, I don't think you'll like that. Everybody in with an egg and a spoon. Look at it. Taking over. It is sports day. No, this is not about sports day. This is about Peter doing what he wants as usual. Yeah? Is he doing the relay as well? I'm on your ankle leg. Good lad. Hey? Do you know what? He gets that from me. Every sports day, I used to win all the sprints. Really? Yeah. Is that true? Yeah, of course it's true. I'll ask Grandad then. Ah, well, you see, unfortunately, Grandad never got to see me on a school sports day. And that's why I'm so proud to be watching you. He's so fast. I'm so fast, when I turn the light out in the bedroom, I'm in bed before it gets dark. Well, you can prove it, Dad's race. Hey, Devendra. So, um, what time's the Dad's race, guys? Uh, I, I don't know. Why are you, you running? Got, uh, podium position last year, mate. Uh, third, 
there are only four in London Susan Clarkson's dad's got asthma. Yeah, but I've lost a few pounds since last year, and the word is that Bradley Watkins' dad has done his cruciate ligaments so hard. But that's running. Oh, uh, really? Well, I... That's not St John's ambulance runs down by then. You could run too. I don't know. Oh, yeah, go on. The problem is, it's a dad's race. As far as I'm aware, you're not a dad, are you? No, uh, sorry about that. Yeah, but your mum was boyfriend, so what does that make you? Not your dad. Yeah. And the head's really strict on these rules. Mr. Packham, Mr. Packham! Yes, what's the problem? So my uncle's mate running the dad's race. He's been mum's boyfriend, so don't that count. Uh, to be honest, we are short of dads again this year, so, um... Well, go on, then, why not? No, excuse me, this... My decision is final. Be I'm not really a sprinter. He smokes not today, Nick. The father's race will be starting in five minutes. That's five minutes. Can all dads go to the start line now, please? Thank you. Put your own blocks and all. No. Pack and veto, does. Uh, come on, gentlemen. Chop, chop. You can pick your sacks up for Mr Jenkins. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What's this about sacks? Uh, it's a sack race. A sack race? I thought we were doing a sprint. Well, we like to ring the changes. Dev, is your sack down? Please. I'm in the zone. Well, never mind the zone. I've got a damp sack. I slip you. I'll break your neck. Dad reckons it's fast, but Nick looks a lot fitter and looks more. Who do you want to win? Well, it doesn't matter who wins, does it? It's only a bit of fun. Advance. Get set. Dad, are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. My sack was all wet and slippery. Oh, never mind. Maybe next year. <laughs> the relay race is starting in ten minutes, so get yourself stretching for that one. Thank you. You did really well at sports day. You're better than Dad. Him and Nick were in the sack race and Nick thrashed him. Well, no, not really thrashed me. Yeah, I'm sure you and Dad will beat me next time. Wow, you've been busy, haven't you? Smoke salmon and everything. Hey, don't worry, there's pizzas for you. <laughs> what kind? That uh, goat's cheese. Well, I'm not eating anything that's quite of a goat. Hey, oi, mind your manners. Carla's worked very hard doing this for you and she's got cake and everything. Is it a chocolate one? No, it's, um, it's carrot. Um, shall I just snip to the shop and get some party food in? No, what? no, you don't have to do that. No, this is fine. You know, you should try some carrot cake. It's nice. And carrots are good for your eyes. Really? Yeah, you don't see many rabbits with glasses on, do you? No, <laughs> oh, you're off your head, you are. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Bit of a domestic. You? Never. Been busy. Yeah, it's suddenly picked up. I don't know what's going on. I've got an idea. Anything I should know? Three of Lloyd's cabs have been put out of action. Mm, bad news for him. Good news for us, which makes it good news all round, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, look, I know that you two haven't exactly seen eye to eye, but he's not a bad bloke, really. In fact, sometimes he's one of the best. Easy. He left me in tears. What are you doing here? Maybe he needs a cab. I hear you're a few short. Have a word. Yeah, you get off, mate. I'll uh, handle things here. Ah, whatever you say, boss. So, do I need to put my running shoes on then? It's all right. Just want to talk. Ah, well, you better come through to my office. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 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 it's so, uh, anybody want a drink? Ken, do you want a drink? Oh. I, I don't believe you. What? Uh, I think what Leanne's trying to say is it wise to be drinking under the circumstances. It's non-alcoholic. Oh, right. Well, in that case, maybe just... Okay. Leanne? No, Tar. Right. I think this little lad's waited long enough. Should we open some presents? Oh, 
Finally. I thought you'd forgotten it was my birthday. <laughs> yeah. Right then, there you go. That's with me and Grandad. Listen, I'm really sorry. I haven't had a chance to go into town yet. What with everything that's been happening. Why? What's happened now? I'll tell you later. We didn't know what you wanted, so we got your gift card. Oh, you could get yourself a book. Yeah, or some toys and a DVD. Or oh, a book. Yeah, give it a rest, Ken. Do you know what, Deirdre? I think he was secretly hoping for one of your pots. <laughs> <laughs> but I suppose it'll have to do with that. Hey, what do you say? Thanks, Grandma. Thanks, Grandad. Good lad. Here you go. And that's from me and Carla. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, Wiki! Hey, hey, that's the latest version. Do you like it? Brilliant. Nick, can you help me set it up? Oh, no, no, I, I can do that for you. Don't be daft, Dad, you rubbish with computers. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Oh, Believe You Out. Uh, and thank you, oh. thank you for the food. Oh, no, mm, it's my pleasure, Ken. Thank you for the stuff. Marry recipe, Deirdre. Try it, you love it. Yeah, yeah well, oh. somebody has to. Mm. Oh. So, uh, we'll see you and Peter at the bistro tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, we'll be there, won't we? Oh, Mr. Of the World. Two birthday parties, eh? Aren't you lucky, eh? Does that mean I get double the presents? Uh, we'll see. Right, we'll get off then. Yeah. Come and say. Bye, Dad. Oh. Happy birthday, son. Hey, 